Ah, shit, I screwed it up. Hello, everybody. I am Omega Recon Gaming, and today I'll be talking about Trigun, the story about Vash the Stampede. So, it's really hard to talk about this anime because it's just so good. I don't want to spoil too much about it. Like, you know. I know it's pretty, you know, popular, but, like, not as popular as I feel it should be. I know this is a little confusing, but, you know, bear with me. So, Trigon is awesome. And... For many reasons. First of all, the characters are all great. Um, especially Wolfwood and Vash. You know. You know. Vash is a very conflicted character. And they, they, writ they wrote him that way. You know, with him. You know, con you know, he has a tragic backstory. You know, all he wants is love and peace. But at the same time, he has a bounty of 60 million double dollars. Which is, you know, 60 million dollars. I don't know why they say double dollars. I'm guessing that's the currency. Um, it's kind of like a future scenario, but a lit, like a dystopian future. Where they have to survive on these plants that support life. And that's all I really can say without spoiling too much. Yeah, the whole show is just... Like, as it it gets so much better as it goes on. At the beginning, it's really goofy. But as it goes on, it gets more serious. And once the plot gets going, it just goes and goes. And it's just firing at you. Until the end where you're just like... Oh my god. It's so good. I've watched it several times. It's it's so good. Uh, if I had to rate it, I want to give it a 10 out of 10, but I can't do it. I'll give it a 9. A 9, 9.5. Um, the soundtrack is great. The animation is great. The characters are great. There's no real... Big flaws, I just, I don't, you know, I can't give it a 10. Because I don't find it the perfect anime. You know, I don't know what it is about it. I just don't, I don't know, it's weird. Maybe, well, I mean, I don't like Marin as much. You know, and she's in a good chunk of it. There are some funny scenes with her, but overall she's just, I don't like her. I don't know what it is. About her. I don't think it's her voice actor. I think she does a fine job. It's just... I don't know. Maybe her dialogue or something. You know, the fact... Maybe it's the fact that she doesn't believe he's Vash the Stampede. Even though it constantly shows proof that he is Vash the Stampede. You know. And everyone else can see it, but she can't. And I find it... And they try to portray her as the smart person. But yet she's fucking blind as shit. This guy is hitting shots that, like, nobody can hit. Like, if I were to shoot something behind me, it would hit something in front of me. That's how lucky, that's how good Fast the Stampede is. He can just go, and it would ricochet and somehow hit the person in front of me without killing them. That's probably the, one of the best things, is, is that this guy, he doesn't want to kill people. You know, he wants to, and he's like, destroyed when someone dies unnecessarily um he tries to solve all of his problems non uh without violence but he does carry a weapon a pistol his pistol his silver destroyer it is a revolver and it is like attached to him almost literally attached to him he is deadly with this thing um, it's really, it's such a good show. The action, oh man, it's so good. Um, 
I don't know. I feel like I just... I don't know. I, the beginning's a little slow, but once you get past the beginning, it really starts to get really good. It's kind of got the opposite of um, Death Note Syndrome. Death Note starts off really, really, really good, and then it starts to peter out towards the end. It still has an okay ending, but... Um, I think everyone can agree the first season was the best. Unless you're weird. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, leave your opinions down in the comments down below.